All right, I know I'm in my jammies and stuff, but I gotta talk about this Kat Von D stuff. I might remake this video when I'm, I don't know, more professional attire. Um, okay, first off, my first thought here is did uh, a tarot reader expose her? Um, secondly, I just gotta say, she was so way off in her comments there. Um, is it because she's a celebrity? She just is all of a sudden an expert on people's moods and their, uh, you know, situations. No, actually, what I've observed is quite the opposite of what she's talking about. And then let's get into the theology of things. No, I see people that have had flame arrows shot, shot at them their whole life and they still choose to be happy, which reminds me of something Jesus said you will be persecuted for my sake, but stay of good cheer. So the real warriors and the real prophets and prophetesses are doing just that. Because somebody vents every once in a while just due to the complete injustice in their lives. It's just like being overlooked while we let criminals run things. Um, you know, a lot of us are isolated and we have to vent it to YouTube. So I'm kind of wondering, has she actually ever read the Bible? Like, has she opened it up? I would challenge that girl to, uh, first off, read about all the prophets. None of them had it cozy and cush. And I'm sorry, just because you've, um, you know, had everything given to you and you're rich. Oh yeah. That was my other main point It's technically according to uh, Christianity and being a follower of Christ. She's not even technically saved until she sells everything she has and gives it to the poor. And I gotta say, I've never met a celebrity in my life. That's out, uh, you know, been willing to save somebody's life for the greater good. Sorry. I would love to uh, know that exists out there, but I've not personally experienced it. Um, so, you know, usually and people get it that are INFJs and are chosens and have had nothing but a life of hell. The more powerful of a tool you are for light, the more you're going to be messed with. We literally have legions of demons coming at us. Now, that reminds me of something I was going to say is like, I used to actually like the girl. Until she got in cahoots with the spirit of religion. And you know what spirit of religion is the ugliest, nastiest, biggest demon? It's Bowser. And you know who it's friends with and runs hand in hand with? Yeah, that's right. The perverts, especially those that prey upon little children. So is she like a pro-trafficking? Because um, a lot of these prophets and prophetesses of God actually are calling out actual crime.